Have you ever wondered? Well, the truth is RGB and hex color codes, they're the same thing. Hex is just RGB written in base 16 instead of base 10. That sounded really nerdy. <laughs> Let me decode that for you for a second. So inside a hex color code, the first two values represent the red, the second two the green, the last two the blue. Now, how does this work when RGB could be RGB 100, 149, 237? They go from 0 to 255, right? So how does this work? Inside a hex color code, it uses values 0 through 9 and then A through F to represent all 16 numbers in base 16. So when you write RGB 100, 149, 237, that's actually the hex color code 6495ED, cornflower blue. Pretty interesting, right? So inside your custom code, totally interchangeable. You can swap them out at any time. Use a web safe color name, use an RGB, use a hex, use an HSL. That's hue, saturation, lightness. I'll save that for another conversation. But one cool thing about the difference here that I think everyone should know is that while RGB and hex are almost exactly the same in terms of how the computer understands what color to display, RGB can have a level of opacity. So let's say you want to add a background to a certain type of text on your Squarespace website, like a summary block title, okay? You want this background to be slightly transparent. You would use an RGBA to adjust the transparency of the background without affecting the opacity of the letters. If you use an opacity code, the whole title of that summary block would become slightly transparent. But if all you want is the background to be transparent, use an RGBA color code instead of a hex color code. Pretty awesome stuff, right? Let me know in the comments if you learned something new.